Hey guys, should tech reviews here the review of the breakaway earphones done by Ankit and I'd just like to thank them so much for sending me out these products for review purposes. Make sure you check out their link along with their Amazon store link down below in the description box. Now these earphones come in four different styles, which is the Serpent Forbidden, Butterfly Breakaway, Bear Naughty Naughty, and Skulls Stay True, and retail for $50 on their website. When you purchase the product, you'll get this very nice packaging with three different sizes of earbuds, which is small, medium, and large, along with the earphones themselves. You also get a very nice catalog along with a pamphlet, doodle pad, and a bag with their logo on it, as you can see, their Ankit logo, along with a semi-joke which says, if you don't buy our earphones, we'll shoot this dog. Now let's just go ahead and get into a more detailed look at the earphones themselves. As you can see, you have a metallic butterfly hand glued to the back of the earphone itself, along with the plastic ear comb with the Ankit logo right there. If you take off this earpiece, you'll notice that you have a very nice mesh cap, which actually prevents dust and dirt from getting inside of the earphones and keeping the sound quality clear and crisp. You also have an L and R on each earbud indicating which earbud goes in which ear. Now if we go down here you'll notice that you have a metallic flower and what this is used is it actually lengthens or shortens the length of the wire and it's very good for cable management. If we go down here you can see this device here it actually makes these tubes go into one big tube and it later leads on to 3.5 millimeter gold plated headphone jack for all standard devices. Now let's just go ahead and get straight on into the features. The first feature is that every time when you purchase a set of their earphones, they'll actually plant a tree. The second feature is their ergonomic design. Now the ergonomic design is pretty much a special design for the earphones in which the cylinders are curved as you can see. This allows you to put these earbuds in your ear for a long period of time without discomfort and helps a lot with noise isolation. Now we're going to talk about the last feature, G-Base technology. Now G-Base technology is pretty much a super high tech driver in which they put in your earphones which allows you to listen to deep rich bass without having to blast your music up to the highest volume. I also really liked how the high notes in the songs were really clear unlike some headphones which have raspy noises when they get super high. So in general, these earphones have a very good sound quality. Now let's just go ahead and get straight on into the pros and cons. The first con about these earphones is that there's no mic. And you're probably wondering why am I saying this? Well, it's due to the price that these earphones retail for on their website, which is $50. I'd advise that they sell a version with a mic for $50 and a version without a mic for $40 on their website. The second con is that there's a decent amount of weight put into the earphones due to these metallic butterflies as you can see. And it's not really a con, it's just pretty hefty and I thought you should know about that but you don't really feel it in your ear. And the last con is the wire, it kind of has that rubbery material that the standard Apple headphones have. So as you guys all know, it gets tangled up really easily so I'll roll it up in my hand and stuff, stuff it in my pocket next thing you know it's all tangled so I have to untangle it and stuff and I just really don't like that. Neither than that there aren't that many cons and let's just go ahead and get straight on into the pros. The first pro about these earphones is the style. The style is absolutely amazing as you can see you have very nice metallic butterflies on the backing of the ear combs and there are many other styles guys I believe three to be exact so check it out down below in the description. And the second pro is the sound. The sound is absolutely amazing due to the G-Bass technology in the drivers. And it has a very nice deep rich bass along with nice high notes and clear and crisp sound. So I definitely recommend it for sound and style. And the last pro is the comfort. These just feel amazing in your ear and as you can see you have three different sizes. Small, medium and large. I personally use the small. They just fit very well in your ear due to the ergonomic design. And I use these for earbuds during a concert, earplugs I mean, and it just works really well with the noise isolation and everything. So I definitely recommend it for comfort as well. So in general, these are amazing earbuds. They have very nice sound quality, style, comfort. The wire does get tangled, but they can't be perfect. 
So do I think they're worth $50? Well, like I said earlier, I don't think they're worth $50. Maybe $40 and $50 for a mic for sure. So make sure you check out their website down below. Thanks to you guys. And I'd probably rate these a maybe 9 out of 10 because I'm really liking these. They've grown on me. When I first started, I didn't like them at all. But after using them for a month or so, I really love these earphones. They're my top two. They're right up there with the Apple in-ear headphones, which retail for $80, while these only retail for $50. So thanks for watching. Thanks to Ankit again. Link in the sidebar. And that's pretty much all I have for you guys for today. So don't forget to rate, favorite, comment, subscribe, and have a nice one.